Hi everybody, welcome to the video for March 2nd, 2010. Our economy continues to generate mixed data that indicates an uneven economic recovery. For example, yesterday, the Commerce Department reported a slightly better than expected rise in personal spending for the month of January. Now that's a good thing, but on the other hand, personal income growth remains stagnant, rising just 0.1% in January uh, compared to a 0.4% uh, jump which had been forecasted by experts. And to make matters worse, disposable personal income, which is uh, basically income after paying for taxes, actually fell. So needless to say, uh, the, the, the data raises further doubts about the potential for a consumer-led economic recovery. Uh, domestic consumption and income growth have been tempered by a very dismal job market and consumers are still trying to dig themselves out from under the vast amount of debt incurred during the last decade of uh, consumption binge. And uh, in our opinion, it will take quite some time to, uh, before we see any meaningful improvement in uh, spending in terms of uh, Americans opening up, opening up their wallets and uh, fueling recovery uh, for the economy. Meanwhile, across the pond, things aren't looking very rosy either as uh, Greece's debt problems remain a major source of concern for many investors. It's expected tomorrow that Greece will outline uh, its plan to reduce the country's budget deficit by four percentage points this year. Uh, the goal, as set by the Greek government, is to uh, cut the deficit from 12.7% of GDP, uh, which was the level that the debt was at last year in 2009, to 8.7% of GDP this year and further down to below the EU limit of 3% uh, in 2012. Now, setting a goal is one thing, actually meeting it is an entirely different matter, and uh, you know, you have to excuse us if we, may, if we remain a little bit skeptical that Greece will be able to accomplish this goal, but uh, only time will tell. And, uh, and an important test for Greece will be the issuance of a new 10-year bond that the government is now working on, uh, while the government hopes to raise between 3 billion and 5 billion euros from the sale, the issuance will also be an, an important limits test uh, of the market's confidence in uh, Greece's ability to pay this debt. Uh, that's it for today. Thank you for watching and uh, join us again soon.